Hey everybody, I'm the Pigglesworth, and welcome back to another episode of Playing on the Rain Cloud Server. Now looking around, you can see all of this stained glass from the CDC lockdown, and guess what? It is about time that we get rid of this mess. I'm just going to switch around here. Got a few things going on. This is a mailbox from a letter that was sent to me by a viewer. I'll go ahead and look this over for you real quick. Rayquaza, Ray, Rayquaza 1. I can't remember how to say this. Uh, but they had sent me a message on YouTube saying they wanted to know why I personally made YouTube videos. And here recently, I did a live stream where I answered that question and I was way out by my plain sight. I was digging a new area for the ghast because we have got to get that guy away from town. He is loud and obnoxious, and I know that he's bothering Kiri, and that's the last thing we want, is to bother server mates, so we're going to have to fix that. But, the first thing we got to fix is this mess. We got to get to the bottom of this CDC thing, because this, in my plane sight, is on lockdown. And look at this. <laughs> this is a... This is a prank from last month. I'm kind of behind the curve here. I've been so busy, I haven't even had time to straighten this prank out. But, uh, let's see. I think it was Rain and Maru. They decided to go give everybody raindrops. It says, this is what happens when Kiri makes us collab, Rain and Maru. <laughs> so we're going to tear down these raindrops. And I, after I get rid of these raindrops, I'm going to go over to the spawn house right there. I'm going to spawn over and meet Rain because I think he's over at his lab. And I'm going to see if I can get all this straightened out. So I'm going to get to doing that. And then I'll meet you over there with Rain. All right, everybody. I'm back over at Rain's house. Oh, and there's his name right through the wall. That's good because I was going to go looking in his house and over by all those animals he has back there. But apparently he is down here in his lab. So we're going to see if we can get this whole mess straightened out. And I wonder if I can just walk in. I see him. He looks like he's working on his computer. Let's just go ahead inside. He looks very busy. Hey, Rain. Whoa, what, what's, who's that? Oh, Hello, Mr. Pigglesworth. How are you? I'm doing very well. Um, I have a question for you. Of course. What can I answer for you today? <laughs> it's... Well, the first thing is I noticed that you're not alarmed that I'm running around in your lab. Is there any reason why you would need to be alarmed? Not particularly. I mean, what's a little mutagenic pig here and there? <laughs> All right. Well, here, let me go ahead and uh, I'm just going to I'm going to spill the beans. OK, we're just going to cut to the chase here. Um, there has been a CDC lockdown in town on my tent and my base. Interesting. Let me check the records. Yes, please. How are you doing that? That is peculiar. My computer says that, in fact, there is a CDC lockdown that was issued by... That can't be right. How are you reading that? It's the same screen. My glasses make everything better. <laughs> but... Oh, man, I gotta get a pair of those. I'm sorry, they're only for scientists. Oh, okay, well, then I'll just, I'll sit here. But yes, according to my computer, it says that I issued the CDC lockdown, which is strange. Are you suffering from any diseases? No swine flu? Uh, not that I'm aware of. I, I could be a carrier, but so... No pig fever? No, uh, no, I, I feel fine. My normal self. That's strange. Something isn't quite right here. But I will lift this because there's no... Well, you're not feeling sick, are you? No, no, I'm fine. You can even take samples if you want. Are you? Are you sure? Yeah, go for it. My scans say... Oops. Oop. <laughs> that was the blood sample. <laughs> it just hurt a little. I'm okay. Just a little. <laughs> My scan says that you're perfectly clear. So I'll go ahead and lift that order. 
Not sure what happened there, but you know, paperwork, it sometimes gets filed strangely. But uh, anyway, thanks for stopping by, and before you leave, please sign uh -huh. this waiver. Uh, on, on the computer? Yes. Can you see what I'm typing? Because I can't. It's just a standard waiver saying that any bodily harm that becomes of you while you are here is not my responsibility. <laughs> well, then I think I will see myself to the door. That's a good <laughs> idea. Because I'm about ready to start the explosive experiments. Oh, w yes. Then we're heading for the door. Thank you very much for uh, re lifting that thing. And I'm out of here. I will shut the door. Let's hope that that door can contain the blast. I don't know if that glass will, but... Oh, man, this is good. Now I can go home, and I can finally get back to doing what I wanted to do, which is build. I really hope that they figure out why in the world I had a lockdown. I'll see you guys back in town. All right, everybody. I managed to make it back to spawn, and some things have changed. There's all kinds of crazy stuff going on. There's... What looks like a TARDIS over there, and a Stargate right here. And I don't know what that is. That that looked weird. <laughs> Uh-oh, that's totally gone. What does this say? Yeah, it's been a little while since I've been on the server since the last clip you saw. And RIP Tiny Nether Portal. Aha, uh -huh, because we got the Monster Nether Portal. Now, I know that uh, Kiri had built this portal. I saw her video where she made this. And from what I know of, Scar built the TARDIS. I'm going to have to look. I can't remember. But there's some crazy stuff afoot in town. But now that we've got the CDC license lifted, finally, we can get to building on the iron farm. Now i got to go over here to my base because there's some stuff i got to collect. And... Huh... Something's not right with my base. What in the world? I just... <laughs> Great, now what? Okay, so let's check. A a piggy present? What, because pigs like dirt? Is that what y'all are saying? Let's see here. So there's buckets of water and dirt. Mud for pig. By Oh, by Curie. Hmm, who else would do something like this? So, dear pig, I noticed you're in desperate need of dirt. Thought it would be a kind gesture to leave some for you at your house. I've also included water in the chest so you can make mud and wallow to your little piggy heart's content. Love, K. Well, that's cool. Too bad you can't make dirt in Minecraft. <laughs> well, yeah, for y'all that don't know, I spent, uh, gosh, I spent one afternoon hanging out with Kiri. And what I would do, here, I'll just show you on camera because this will drive her crazy. Watch this. I would break a block. And, uh oh. There's another one that's already missing. But I would run over here and I would break a block. <laughs> Just like this. <laughs> Might as well let's go for it, right? Because we got to collect more dirt. I don't think we got enough dirt over there. But anyway, I would run around the warehouse and I would break. Break a bunch of blocks, right? And then I would hide in the corner back there by the by the spawn house. And I told Kiri, something happened to the path. And she freaked out. She came over, she started filling in the dirt. And when I knew she was doing that, while she was right here, I would be over there and I'd break a block. And I would come behind her and break the blocks. So she would run in a circle and keep seeing blocks missing. Ah, uh, that was a lot of fun. So I think that's her way of trying to tell me, Piggy, you want so much dirt here. I'll just bring you a bunch of dirt. So thank you, thank you, Kiri. I know everybody thinks that's a prank, but that's something nice. She did something nice for me. So I'm going to tear up all this dirt and collect it up. And then I'm going to head over to my plane site because I got a few more materials I got to grab. And we can get working on the iron farm. All right. Well, with all the dirt removed, we can go over here to the plane site so that we can. Oh, great. What's this? <laughs> what is that? Hmm, that looks so innocent, doesn't it? I bet that's why it looks innocent. I bet it's Trixie. You know what it looks like? You ever see like in the old cartoons where they had like the box with the little handle that you would whoop, push down and something would blow up? 
Yeah, I have a feeling. Uh-huh, look at this. Something did blow up. Somebody's been up to no good. Wait a second. <laughs> what in the world? Okay, uh, oh. To Biggles, for the lovely quartz farm, love, K. Wow, K, you're on a rampage, I tell you what. And that sounds like a chicken bomb in there. Hmm. And the sun's going down. I don't know about this. We're... Is this griefing? I mean, she built this, and I'm breaking it. Is this considered griefing? We will have to take that up with the, the audience. You guys, write in the comments below. Do you think that me tearing up a build on my area that somebody else built, is that griefing? I don't think it is. But, let's see. Get us some food. And we're going to carefully pop the top on this. Uh-huh. Look at that. It's a chicken bomb. <laughs> Darn it. I was going to say what would be fun is to TNT this thing, but there's so much junk around here, I don't want to... Hmm. You know what? I think I'm going to make this a real chicken bomb. I'm... I need to close this top off. I don't want anything bad to happen here. I'm going to go get me some TNT because I'm pretty sure I got the materials for it. And uh, I'm going to meet you back over here. We're going to create a chicken bomb. Um, now, while I'm doing that, I... Uh-oh. Oh, I did this wrong. Okay. I've got some footage that uh, I had been saving that looks like I'm going to need to use. And it is, uh, recently, we, uh, surprised Zombie. Like, you know how I've been going around getting, giving everybody gifts? And it seemed like I wasn't giving Zombie a gift. Well, I finally gave her a gift. It's because it took forever to make this gift. So, I'm going to go figure out where in the world I put all the stuff for my TNT. Ooh, bad guys are spawning. That's not good. We're going to jump down here. So, I'm going to find out where in the world I put all the stuff for my TNT. Y'all watch this cool footage about hanging out with Zombie, and we're going to make a chicken bomb. So I'll be right back. <laughs> well, I guess since I have the tickets, I will jump in the ticket booth. Good luck. Oh, yeah. Here, you got to take out the door. Oh. <laughs> there you take go. Take out the door. <laughs> and then put the door back? Okay. So, there we go. <laughs> so um, yeah, I guess I'm just going to have to toss these, and whoever doesn't get one or gets multiple, just share. Form a line, so. savages. Oh. Yeah, seriously. Are we? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Zom zombie first. Oh. Zombie, Where go get she? your ticket. She's like all <laughs> slow. She's being creepy. Oh. Hey, you can imagine. no cutting. Ouch. Who hit me? <laughs> oh, I overthrew that one. <laughs> Mr. Cards. <laughs> we if you get the golden ticket, then let us know. <laughs> I kind of suck ticket. at like server things together. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right, move out of the way now, Rain. Yeah. <laughs> he wants all the tickets. I barely had room for the ticket. I didn't realize how much crap I have in my inventory. Canning town, eh? Does everybody have one? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. So Are we to make can the magic. Something? We're going to can things. We're going to watch Zombie Sweet. Can. That's her surprise. She gets Fantastic. to work for us. So to make your ticket work, you have to click the button. Wow. <laughs> How did that work? <laughs> oh, it, it takes the nearest user, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I don't like this. What are you doing? Uh, oh, come on, Zombie. It's okay. You guys broke the button. Um, who shot the button with an arrow? Oh. Scar. It's okay, zombie. You can trust me. I'm a I'm a trustworthy pig. Because I, I can know. say Those I can say D Xner. I can say D Xner. Look at that. Scar, why is Don't go up there. Resetting? Hang on. Because K keeps um, hitting it. I, I, I no, that's not true. It just won't reset. I blame K. I, I, I so, blame you. I spawned inside so, of it. As I say, this is like the Matrix. We're stuck inside this subway now forever. There you go. Yes. Yeah, that didn't get cleaned up. Just ignore the chest. <laughs> <laughs> Pay no attention to the man behind the curtain. <laughs> so is that everybody? It's a trash bin. Where's Scar? I'm here, I'm here. There we go. Okay. Is this Canning Town? 
This is Canning Town, or yeah, close to it, I think. Follow the so, pig. So check Follow this out. Follow the yellow brick pig. Woohoo! Follow the yellow brick pig. So do you know where you are, zombie? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I, it's a far cry from London, but we tried. Where's, where's one place you desperately wanted to go this year? Maybe like <laughs> the weekend of July. Maybe the first Oh, one. now she's hiding. Come back. Okay, so here's what's going on. on. You were going to try and go to Minecon. Uh -huh. And you were not able to go. Mm -hmm. So as soon as all that happened, we got together and we started working on the Excel Center so we could go to Minecon with you. <laughs> so if you'll step inside, you can see that everybody is here with you at Minecon. <laughs> it's a really, really terrifying place, apparently. <laughs> it's really terrifying. <laughs> Combies, I think, is the funniest looking, actually. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like Homer Simpson. <laughs> Although, I don't know, Static's face looks a bit weird. <laughs> yeah, that was the best I could do. <laughs> I, I really struggled with his face. <laughs> and then there's Static. <laughs> <laughs> good times, good times. I like the raindrop, personally. Well, that's actually supposed to be Cordis's, uh <laughs> like, helmet. Uh, See, I'm look at... My helmet. Yeah. <laughs> oh, weird! <laughs> Check this out. Stay still, Cordis. Stay still. Everybody get close to him. You can see his face through the mask if you look sideways. Well, not all at once. <laughs> I see pig's face. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, yeah. It's like you can yep, yep. see through the layer. I don't it's like, like it. I don't you know, alternatively, you can hit tab and all of the faces uh, pop up. Oh, that's too easy. <laughs> Ow. Uh, uh, oh, and um, <sighs> zombie, there's one more thing over here. Philippe uh, built this for you. Oh. And just to prove to you nothing terrible is going to happen, I'll stand right here. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, come over here. Okay, everybody's got to be quiet so you can listen. you got to push that button. Wait, what? Why did you punch what me button? Oh, that button. <gasps> That's close enough. Oh, my God! <laughs> That moment when she realizes what song it is. <laughs> wow, he made a long song on Yeah, that. he did. When I played it, I was like, good, gracious, please. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like scared to go down there and see all the redstone. I know, right? <laughs> don't, don't do it, it's terrible. <laughs> So this is the surprise we've been working on for what, like a month or two now? Oh yeah. <laughs> it's we been should a definitely while. expand upon it though. We should definitely add like conference rooms and the expo center and mini games. <laughs> oh yeah, as far as like for future projects, we've been thinking about making like whenever somebody new gets on the server, we go ahead and add their face. Like this is going to be the hall of uh, just the hall of different shame? people. <laughs> no, not the. <laughs> The Hall of Fame. It is Rain Cloud, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Rain Cloud. It's much like Alcatraz. You leave. <laughs> um, but I can't remember. Scar will have to show us later. But in one direction is where his artwork for the Scar SMP pictures are at. So I have no, to stay away from that. Out across the ocean. Okay. Um, but yeah, in uh, back behind the building and to the side, maybe we could eventually plan for like uh, mini games area and just different. Oh, I'm sorry. I was I was waving a fish to point and yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, 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 oh. Cry fish now. Ah. And Maru picks up my tears as usual. Thank you, Maru. You're welcome. Oh oh no! If I had a bucket of water, but I don't. Oh. Zombie, run inside the, the hall. There's tons of water in there. Oh, come on. You killed me once. I just burned you a little bit. That was she cool. actually <laughs> killed you because she was trying to kill me. <laughs> I just stepped out of the oh, way. God. 
Just listen to the song, people. Uh, <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Here we go. Goodbye. Let the song soothe you. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I was going to try and give you an ender pearl, but I didn't make it in time. I did. I, I just couldn't get back to the water in time. <laughs> okay, so let me see if I can remember this. D ice or D Xner. There we go. I think I got it right. <laughs> D Xner. <laughs> I don't know why that works, but it does. <laughs> hey, you know sure, let's pretend that that works. <laughs> What's that? You could read English letters. <laughs> the Xner is the guy that told you in stream that you were his favorite YouTuber. I know, and I just. <laughs> I'm such a bad pig. <laughs> All right, light me on fire. Let's get this over with. Oh, I will gladly oh, do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's the roast. <laughs> Everybody enjoy some bacon. <laughs> All right, everybody. That was a lot of fun, and I'm glad I finally got to do that. We worked on that for so long for Zombie, and I was just getting worried that she was going to feel left out. I was getting gi giving gifts to everybody else but her. So that, was, that really was a lot of fun. But we are all set up because we... We're not going to have time to go work on the iron farm today. We have been distracted. We have been diverted. We've been attacked by K is what we've been. So we're going to deal with this. The only way to to deal with the chicken bomb that's inside is we have to defuse it. We've got to defuse it. So I've set up some redstone. I put water around this because I, I know that TNT, when it blows up in water, water will kind of... Uh, buffer the area. It shouldn't let things get blown up. I went ahead and moved all my stuff just in case and got creepered in the process. So a little bit of my little fake vine farm here got, got blown up, but that's all good. So we've got all this set up. I think we're safe. We're ready to go. And we're going to give this a countdown and blow these, um, get rid of this present. <laughs> so we're going to do us a little countdown. Three, Two, one. Uh oh, there it goes. Nothing. Oh, there it went. <laughs> oh man. And the water absorbed the TNT. Well, darn it. We're going to have to figure out something else. We're going to have to put TNT elsewhere. So I'm going to take a quick cut. We're going to blow this thing up. <laughs> I'll be right back. All right, everybody. <laughs> I, I got rid of the water. I replaced the torches because they got blown up. And we decided maybe twice the amount of TNT is what is needed. Okay? So, hmm. Let's just try this. I wonder if when that blows up, it's going to send that flying. This might be disastrous. <laughs> so let's find out. Are we ready? So three, two, one. Uh oh, there it goes. What? Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh man, that was awesome. That was serious. Oh no, the tree. Oh my gosh, the plain sight sign. No. Oh man. Oh, at least it didn't destroy that. Okay, so I have a huge... This isn't a creeper crater. This is a piggy crater. So we got to fix this. So I'm going to go get all the dirt that Kay left me. And I'm going to use it to fill in this hole. And I will see you guys in the next episode.